Hi, I'm Jamie with Iron Horse Trailers, and today we're going to look at the one bike flip top and how to load it without it being attached to a tow vehicle. Uh, the first step in any of that is to always scotch your, your tires. Um, do this on both sides of the trailer, both sides of the tires. These are kind of handy, got the string between them. Uh, wedge those in there pretty good. It keeps the trailer from rocking back and forth as you load. Uh, the another thing we'll do is make sure that your tongue hatch is it's pretty level. On the Iron Horse, we recommend about 16 inches. Uh, you can adjust it right there. And then we'll go to the back of the trailer. Leash will drop the stabilizer bars. These are kind of unique. We'll go ahead and the bar down as we can get them and then pull them up just a little. Uh, safety pins will hold them in place. see those if you can see this they're a little loose they're not hardly on the ground and what, the, what I'll do is go back to the front of the trailer and raise the front of the trailer just a little bit to put some pressure on those and you'll feel it kind of tighten up let you know that you've got them I always like to double check them though yeah, those are good and solid all right from there this trailer has the optional ramp extension on it um, and basically what it does it takes this bump off it's not, uh, not entirely necessary. A motorcycle will go right over it, but if you want that nice smooth ride in, that will take care of that. Uh, release your safety straps for the top. Raise it up. And then we're ready to ride a motorcycle in there. Let's do that. Once you get the bike in, of course, strap it down there and they always kind of wiggle it to make sure the wheel chop's got it caught right. It looks pretty good there. Depending on tire height and width, sometimes it can let your bike lean a little bit. Uh, just make sure it's good and sturdy before you get off and walk away from it. But other than that, that's all there is to it. Iron Horse Trainers makes it really easy to load your Iron Horse without it being attached to a tow vehicle. Uh, so you can put it in your garage, leave the bike in the garage or whatever circumstance you may have. It's the stabilizer bars do their job. The trailer's easy to load and unload. Uh, this makes uh, a great motorcycle trailer, and that's what we try to build here at Iron Horse Trailers. Thank you. we got more videos coming. Stay tuned.